welcome to soft tree demo again today i come up with a new content related to procurement and construction and oil and gas industry this content contain cost accounts funding source spending plans budget plans so this all are related to accounts and cost so basic our content today is cost account so i will open my primavera p6 without delaying i will open my project here so here my project window is open as i leave it recent my unnecessary columns here first of all we will go for cost account so here we can see cost account option here and we can also go for enterprise and from enterprise we can also go for cost accounts so what is cost accounts here so we can see i have another cost account for my another project so here we can see we i make a cost account for my ipc1 ipc2 ipc3 up to ipc18 and also i make cost some cost account for civil estimate building building civil building mac mechanical estimate pipeline civil pipeline mechanical pipeline ei i make different cost accounts so here we can add new cost accounts here is my project cost plant labor material we can also make accounts type type like that we can add here a new account here so my new account name is for example my new account name is resource so i i change my cost into resources resource here i write total i write here total resource cost here i can write numbers cost account number name ids whatever we like i will shift in into it and it's 0400 it's a maybe material cost and then i will add here this one this one may be labor cost labor cost and the third one is maybe add here a third one add here labor non labor cost here non labor cost account here three cost account here cost account here we write here completely cost account here cost account count and the last one i add here is my expense account expense cost account so i created my basics accounts and sub accounts here i can add here in a sub here if there are many type of expensive i can make other accounts here so we can create many types of accounts and sub accounts here so i i generally make four accounts here and i close here now i will go for my project here i see my activities here we i can see my activities no i right click here customize my column here i can see here here i will find a cost account here and in the second position i will put cost account here here we can see cost account and when we click on there and we will go for definitely our cost account and here filter by current i will filter all the costs here and now i will go for our resource resource this one i created and i will first assign this one resource this one first i will go for there and this is a labor and then then i will go for here we can see here 
and this one is material so we can differentiate you can see here cost account we assign labor and law labor but we can differentiate it by bill number bill 1 bill 2 maybe i can add here bill 1 i can add here bill 1 so we can differentiate it by there so we can also right click here and add a column of cost accounts here from journal we will go for journal and we will find here cost accounts if we don't find anything we will right click here and we will add account cost account ids cost accounts and ids i will add here after activity here we can add here cost account and cost ids you can see here there i assign two ids two accounts to my resources so it's it's best better for resources you can go for resource assignment you can right click here column you can go for customize here you can go for journal here or you can click here a cost account and you can go for here and you can put here your cost accounts from easily here so you can easily for example i if i type here easily if there is bill 2 so i click here up to there and fill down yes yeah, easily you can see here if there is this one part is bill 3 and up to there i can see here and fill down you can easily add all the cost accounts from here to from here fill down so you can easily see here so we can also group and sort by customize here and we can also group and sort by cost accounts here we can see calendar cost accounts okay level 1 level 2 you can see here bill 1 bill 2 bill 3 IPC1, IPC3, IP4, IPC4. This is no cost account. These activities have no cost accounts. So you can see I have assigned some cost accounts to different activities. So this this will be can be managed your financials and your finance finance accounts by these activities and what you are resources cost based you can assign cost accounts to your resources so also we can go for expenses and we can also add here add here customize here and for general we can also add a cost account here the simple same we can also add you can see here arrow button it's mean this is this is cost account is assigned already so this is we can also assign in the expenses we can also same assign assign cost account to our expenses so this one my cost account content is over i will go for projects now i will tell you about budget budget log so here i will create a budget log so how i will create a budget log i will add a, a budget here on 17 february how much dollar i have i have like 100 thousand dollars and who is responsible abc is responsible and is it approved or pending is if you approved it then your current budget and your proposed budget will be same your original budget if you want to be zero so your cost will be balanced if your original budget you have right here any amount so it will be add here in current budget and proposed budget so if your account is zero so you can write here zero it will be added in current budget and proposed budget if there is pending pending any your standard status pending pending so then your proposed budget will be one hundred thousand dollars so reason if there is account is pending then you have to write a reason number you can write number of your budgeted plan so it's not approved reason is approved we don't require any reason or approved any reason so here i write one thousand dollars 
so i will go for spending plans so here are my spending plans so you know we have 100000 dollars advanced on 17 february you can spend it before 5000 here 50000 here 50000 here and 5 50000 and 50000 here and we have to write here total benefit plan 55000 here so you can write here 55 after spending here you can write here what the amount is actually so here is your total undistributed variance and here is benefit plan so from the budget summary you can see current variance is 50000 of variance because you don't have budget we have 100000 dollars and we spend 150000 dollars but our benefit plan is 165000 dollars so i show you here i i write the my here so here i so i show you here i write my benefit plan and here i write my spending plan and in the summary here is spending plan and benefit plan 165 total and here is 150 total we earn here 15 15000 and so here is our variance between budget and spending plan so i tell you about budget log spending plan and budget summary so here is funding so if your funding is coming from anywhere any shares so you can add your funding source here any source you have funding you can add here source of funding and you can add here share so this is overall project spending plans budget logs and fundings and the other i tell you this one is in the project and this one is enterprise and this one in is cost accounts i show you this one so this is my today's lecture like comment and share if you don't subscribe my channel till now then subscribe it and press the bell icon to get your latest upcoming notification see you in next video